What's up, y'all? We're gonna learn how to take underwater photos on a budget. Roll intro. All right, so I did play Colors of the Cross at Otterbein, so you guys can't say anything about me trying to act like an athlete. Shout out to the boys, go Cards, good luck this weekend. Happy spring break. I wonder if we're gonna win anything. This is so cool that they do this like little roll up thing. I hope I want a car. If I want a car, I'll give it to one of you. I swear to God. All right, so today's video is just gonna be a little quick video on how exactly to take underwater photos on a budget, because a lot of us, including me, do not have all the money in the world. I can't afford a $1,500 to $3,000 Aquatech Solutions housing for my Sony camera or whatever. So I'm gonna show you guys a little trick on how I take amazing underwater photos, but for a heck of a lot less. So the easiest option is obviously a GoPro. A GoPro is 4K and it's waterproof, but a GoPro can only get you so far. You can only do so many things. So, I have another way. My other way is a Telesyn dome housing. Now, you guys, if you guys don't know what this is, this thing is amazing. So what a dome housing does is when you put a camera into it, it pushes the water around it so that it gives you that half and half look like I showed you guys in one of my old tutorials, the uh, how to edit your GoPro photos. So if you get one of these, you can really start to make some really cool photos where you can see underwater and above at the same time. And it's really simple. This thing's about $50. This thing's about $400. So when you add it all up, that's a $450 camera that you're taking amazing professional photos with compared to um, maybe a $3,000 camera with another $2,000 housing. So this is great for a heck of a, a lot less. And if you're on a budget like me or anyone else in the world, this is a great little option. It can bend right here so you can really kind of get low. You can press the buttons and everything just like you would on a normal GoPro and it can float so it won't sink. As you can see, there's still water in it from Costa Rica. Yeah, I've taken this thing to Costa Rica, Mexico with me. It's great, I love it. Um, it even comes with a little bit more couple gadgets. Um, it comes with like one of these. I don't use this thing, but if you attach it right, you can take photos from a distance and like hold it away from yourself. Um, but yeah, this thing's kind of cool. Oh yeah, Jack's not here today. I don't know what the heck he's doing. He said he had something called class. Yeah, nerd. Anyways, one of my favorite Instagrammers, 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 is uh, Nolan Amura from Hawaii. I hope I said your name right. He kind of like got me inspired to start taking this kind of thing. But um, yeah, totally cheap option. And if it breaks, it breaks. That's only $450 out of your pocket, not five grand like you normally would. But you know what? Thank you guys for watching. It's been a fun one. It's been really quick. But before we go, let's see if uh, we won anything. Alright. It's a lot easier with your mouth. This is probably not the most appealing thing on the internet. Ooh, I want a coffee. I want another one of these. Yes, it says one in six chances to win. And I won. I want a coffee. Awesome. Alright. That stuff's so good. I didn't have any food from Tim Hortons today. It feels weird. I don't know what's going on with me. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to subscribe, like this video, dislike this video if you're that kind of guy, if you're like Jack. I'll ring the bell so that you know when I upload a video and you're like, hey guys, Drew just uploaded a video. Let's go watch it. I'm sure it's super dope. You probably don't say that. Peace. See you later in the next one.